hello guys welcome to design in this video we will be talking about pattern feature and as well as mirror feature so as you know in uh, sketcher environment itself uh, we have discussed uh, pattern curve and as well as the mirror curve that is so similar um, uh, application will be there in uh, 3d as well so we'll just uh, create one uh, sketch for this so let's go to sketch and uh, just i will just make one cube here and i'll just uh, make it as a 3d extrude and as you can see here this um, feature is there now extrude feature so i just wanted to make this mirror uh, with respect to xz plane so this is how it works actually uh, it just copies the the same extrude with respect to any of the plane so we'll go to pattern sorry mirror feature insert and the mirror feature once you select this uh, you can see here the feature to mirror it is asking the feature and this is my feature and specify the point uh, regarding this reference point i will just explain you later and uh, this is the plane the plane you just wanted to select so i am selecting xz plane so this uh, feature will be mirror to the other side you click ok so regarding the reference point i'll just uh, tell you so this is the reference point suppose if you want to select the reference point on a existing feature you can select this with this reference point uh, the body will be mirrored so this is not mandatorily you just need to select it by default it will take the center of the feature so it can find uh, if it is uh, there in the center as well so if you click ok the mirror feature will be selected so now i will show you how uh, pattern feature works so let's go to the same insert associated copy and uh, pattern feature so pattern feature is nothing but it will just copy the same feature either in a single direction or else in a circular pattern or else if you want in any other direction so there are so many number of uh, options here you can just go through each and everything either you can do it by a general by point one point to another point so oral circular oral linear oral you can have a look at these things and now i will just uh, show you the linear and circle circular those these two are the mainly used for uh, all modeling purpose so i'll just select the feature and uh, first we will make a linear linear is nothing but in a single direction along any vector so so it will select uh, we just selected a feature and now we will go to specify the vector along which vector you want to pattern you can see here if i select the y direction so it will propagate along the y direction if i select x it will propagate along x if you select z it will propagate along z direction so if you want you can just give the count and span as similar to the whatever we have discussed in sketcher environment so i'll just click ok as you can see here it is patterned suppose if you want in some other direction so you can give even the edge also as a reference vector so i'll just create one uh, line here so along this line i need a pattern i need pattern so i'll just uh, click pattern feature and select the feature sorry select the feature and this vector i just want to give this as you can see here this feature will propagate along this direction like this you can give any direction you can select any edge edge of any of the feature so in order to get a pattern so this is how it works for a linear uh, pattern so now we will go to circular feature circular pattern sorry so just select a model and then go to specify the vector so i'll just select this to circular so now it will ask for the vector i'll select z as my vector and then you can give a count as 5 and uh, pitch angle as 23 it's fine or else i will give 45 so you can see here it is a 
patterned along circular direction so these feature will be very useful when you have uh, holes so i'll just um, explain how it, it will be useful for uh, everyone so suppose you have one uh, one plate with a circular uh, diameter of 400 and okay and i'll just extrude this so let's make it as 20 okay and suppose this is a plate and there are some holes with a circular pattern so during this time what you have to do is we just select the plane and uh, make single hole so i'll just make a single hole here and uh, just remove this and select this and uh, give the opposite direction boolean operation subtract click ok as you can see here this subtract this is actually a subtract which is the operation is already done in uh, the extrude itself so what i will do is this hole i just wanted to make it as a pattern along this plate so in this case you will it will be very useful for you so go to pattern feature and uh, i already told you always select the feature by part navigator so prefer to my recommendation is to select the feature by part navigator so just i will select the part navigator uh, from the part navigator so now i will give the vector as you can see here this vector i will just provide and it is asking for a point it's okay fine you can give uh, the 0 0 0 point or else i'll just create the point at some that point and as you can see here count and uh, I'll just give the count and span so 5 is needed and 360. So you can see here that hole will be created and patterned along circularly. In si this situation, it will be the pattern feature will be very useful, guys. So please subscribe to my channel and uh, hit a like button. Thank you.